Live from Don't Ever Bank Your Field in Croxham Skull, Florida, it's time for some mutant football. It's hard for me to figure out what my favorite part of coming to Florida is. The best part of Florida is leaving so you can read the headlines instead of witnessing them. This is the only place that the nuclear wasteland actually improved. And today's matchup is going to be a good one. The teams are taking the field. The Motor City Maniacs battle. The Crux and Skull Jugulars. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Welcome to another game day here on the MFL Network. Grim Blitzrow along with my partner, Brickhead Mulligan. How you doing? Great city, isn't it, Bricks? Fantastic city. My motel even has free color TV. Oh, that's and nice. an ice machine that works. Wow. That was police tape blocking the bathroom because of the photographers in there, but other than that, no complaints. They give you free jelly at breakfast, too. Sounds like a real winner. And there aren't many things better than a running back blasting through the defense for a big gain. Hacks of pizza. Yeah, I'm sure you got pizza. Uh, and burritos. Okay, you make a good point. Oh, oh, and pickles. Gotta have pickles. And it's first and ten. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's gonna have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. Third down and the punter is warming up. trick that'll wake you up and then put you to sleep permanently you snooze you lose unless you're in a sleeping contest and kickers practice for this kind of kick every day pretty standard nothing standard when you got bloodthirsty mutants on the defensive line the kick is good and as expected those are pretty much just gimmies Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. He sets up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. And it's first and ten. And they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. You know, Bricks, when the ref is faster than your football team, you've got some serious issues. And the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. First down and forever. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. Oh, mama! He just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. And it's 
First and ten. He was stuffed at the line of scrimmage. So was that cheerleader. Second down and ten. Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. Third down, and, well, good luck. You've got to catch that. Don't do anything stupid here. Just punt the damn ball and play defense. And he booted a high arcing rainbow. And he's got a chance for a good return here. Oh, devastating hit. You ever get hit that hard, Bricks? Yep. Third grade. Sister Mary Margaret of Our Ladies of Holy Hell. I thought it was brass knuckles, but it was just a regular knuckles. down in a lot. a decent punt. Nice catch. And he turns on the... Oh, he just got crushed. And it's first and ten. He was starting to go somewhere, but he gets stumped after three. They usually stop me after three, too. You know, at the all-you-can-eat buffets, they're not as literal as you'd think. Second down and seven. And he runs it for four yards. Third down and three. And that's a run for no gain. Then it's not really a run, is it? Boring, but smart. Time to punt. Whoa, whoa, you can't say that on the radio. That's the end of the first quarter, and it's still anyone's game. Well, sometimes the best thing to do is just punt and let your defense get the ball back. Nice punt. Should move him back nicely. He's got the ball now, and he's going to try and score. That, my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. Oh. 
And it's first and ten. Murphy Brown! What? I mean, first down! What the hell was that? I, uh, I honestly don't know, Grim. And the defense jumps off sides trying to mutilate the QB. <laughs> oh, wow. If you're a defender, the only good QB is a dead one, Bricks. Oh, he must be pretty good then, because he is dead. And it's first and ten. Down and six. And that was a perfect pass, and he scores handily. No, why go for one when you could go for two? It's always been my philosophy, but Bricks can't even get one. Oh, you're talking about one. And it closed forward for the two-point conversion. <laughs> when you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do? And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot. And that is caught for a first down. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. hot. He is running like an old guy looking for a bathroom. First down. And it's first and ten. A brutal hit. <laughs> Second down and two. Hot. Hot one. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. Straight through the uprights. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. First and ten. Oh. And the quarterback calls a sonic blast dirty trip. Oh, and that one's gonna hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. <laughs> Second down in a very lot. the way to move the chains that's good for a first down this game is all about momentum and killing 
And it's first and ten. And it's your mother of a giant don't Some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sinners then. The kick is good. And as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. They need a good return here to set up the offense. Just catch it, run it back, and don't die. First and ten. Not, not one, not one. Man, this guy just exploded into flames. Now the defense has to try to tackle a running bonfire. First down! And this guy is a stud, Bricks. Yeah, tell him me! Nice run! No, I mean, he's a real stud. He works at the Mutant Stud Farm weekends and summers. Huh? Two minutes left in the half. First and ten. Not, not one, not and they just popped his eyes in the back of his head. That quarterback's gonna be hurting, or dead, or worse. They stump the clock with their first timeout, leaving them with two in case they need them. Yeah, just like condoms, hatchets, and wives, huh, Grim? You know, you just summed up why we don't get together outside of work, Bricks. Oh, man, the defense brought a sack lunch today. Hey, hey, don't eat him. Not until he's cooked. You want to do some better time. A timeout is called by the quarterback. They have one left. Third down, and the QB is saying his prayers. Two. And a nice pass for a 10-yard gain. It's not a first down in the stat line, but it's a first down in a... Smart move there as they call a timeout, trying to get the ball back for another shot. Well, they couldn't pick up a first down, so now they have to punt. Rainbow. He's got the ball now. Let's see what he does with it. Oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grim. You're right. That's a killer. It was right there, and then he dropped it. Oh. Scumbag is killing me in the fantasy league. Second down and ten. Oh, with the brain scrambler. Well, that's two timeouts burned. And you have to wonder, Bricks, are they desperate or are they in control? Yeah, I'm speaking from experience, Grim. But it really is hard to do both at the same time. And I have made this guy's gonna get mugged in the locker room by his team after the game and they'll line up for the punt here he boomed that one let's see if they can get a return drop and 
played safe, and the defense says we'll take it. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. He picks up ten yards on that play. Second down, the size of Bricks Wiener. Hey, sorry, partner. It's a close battle at the quarter ends. Halftime is brought to you by those caring folks at Monsatan Industries. They make the world a better place by making the government tell you it is. We're at the start of the third quarter in a nail biter. The teams line up for the second half kickoff. <laughs> The teams are lined up for the kickoff. They're going to be able to return this one. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. And it's first and ten. Give them four more downs to punish the defense. And you better believe they will. And it's first and ten. And he snatches that one out of the air for a first down. See if they can get something going here. First and ten. And into the end zone for a touchdown. Once he got his hands on that pass, he was on to the races. <laughs> okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. Straight through the uprights. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. First and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. And he's running like a moose right. Receiver makes a grab for five yards. Second down and five. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. And it's first and ten. It's a six-yard gain. And that'll be second down and four. Hot one, hot two, hot which will slice its way through any defensive player trying to block it. That's really put the Nicely done for a first down. <laughs> for 
first down and six. Hot, hot one, hot two. Maybe the QB should throw it and catch it too. Second down and six. Hot, hot one. Oh, he, this guy just blew up and he's on fucking He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. Why we love the NFL! <laughs> Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright for God's sake. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. And it's first and ten. at Speedy's drive through Funeral Parlor Service located just off the Beltway Exit 5. Second down and a muffin says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. That's a killer. It was right there, and then he dropped it. Oh, scumbag is killing me in fantasy league. Third down, and the offense needs a miracle. Sticks his fingers in the defender's eyes, netting him a pickup of about eight on the play. Well, here comes the punting unit. You know, punters really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah? Oh, yeah, I have pictures that, uh, well, maybe I actually shouldn't discuss this on here. The return man catches the ball and heads up feet. Ouch! What is this, 80s wrestling? First and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot three. One potato, two potato, three potato, four. The defense just blew up a player who thought he was going to score. <laughs> oh, that hot potato dirty trick gets him every time. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one. Should learn from this. He's dead, you moron. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one. Should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> it's good. Ooh. 
The teams are lined up for the kickoff. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. And it's first and ten. The defense puts one over on the quarterback with a sticky ball dirty trick. The only thing the QB can do now is run for his life. Or die. Second down and long. Third down and long. And they went to the air and came up big. Most kickers should be able to make this one. Score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. And it's first and ten. Second and one. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. And it's first and ten. Oh, with the brutal hit. First and ten. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. Third 
First and four. point attempt. First and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. Oh, he just got crushed. Second down and five. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. Oh, nice hit. Bring up third down and seven. I don't remember calling 911, but the SWAT team is out in full force at the line of scrimmage. Nice play by the linemen. And the punter takes a break from knitting on the sidelines to come in and punt. His knitting is superb, Grim. That cross stitching, unbelievable. He's got the ball now and is going to try and score. Oh, and that one's going to hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. And it's first and ten. And they're picking up chunks of yards now. Nice reception for ten yards. Second down in inches. Like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. It sounds like my off season. And it's first and ten. And he pulled out a chainsaw and now he's. <laughs> Disturbing, yet interesting. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? Straight through the uprights. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Well, it looks like he wanted to run before he caught it. You gotta keep your eye on the ball. Come on, you dirtbag. You gotta make that catch. Second down and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot. And the quarterback drills one in for the first down. Under two minutes, a timeout means the QB is playing beat the clock, and he better win. The quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry-up offense. Hot two. Oh, 
with the brutal hit. And it's first. They've got one more timeout left, but they've stopped the clock. Why don't they just take the batteries out of the clock, Grim? That would make more sense. The offense changes the pace by going into a hurry up. Does that mean the defense gets If you can't get the sack, that's the next best thing. And the offense goes into a hurry up to pick up the pace of the game. Hot two. Third down in the off, and they are out of timeout. The clock just became their greatest enemy. Really? The clock? The clock, Grim? I can smash a clock. That's not a great enemy. We're not talking about waking up in the crack of noon. We're talking about the NFL, you moron. Oh, what a run there. Touchdown. No one was going to stop him. Mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. It's good. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chimp wearing a wig. First and ten. Oh, sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time. And we are all tied up and we're going to overtime. Go ahead and cancel that quality time with the family and continue to stream at your television. This is going to be great. Breaks overtime is a war with some basic rules. The first touchdown wins the game, but if the team that receives the kickoff gets a field goal, then the other team is allowed a possession too. After that, whomever scores wins. Here comes the kickoff. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. Second down in a lot. First down! He was not going to drop that one. They need to make him a target more often. And it's first and ten. Starting to click now. A pickup of eight on the play. Second down and two. Nicely done for a first down. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. And that's a run for no gain. Second down and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot. Oh, that's a vicious hit. And the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300 pounds of ground mutant me. And you can't hit a guy much harder than that. And that is unfortunate. Hot, hot two, hot. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. 
And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. First and four. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. And he breaks through for a touchdown. Listen to this crowd. Yay. The Crux and Skull Jugulars took their city's name to heart and win the game. Trench warfare. Both teams battling back and forth, bruised and battered, but in the end, there could be only one winner. There are winners in my book. I think that a few teams should get a participation award because you know, they try really hard. Why don't you try real hard and shut the fuck up? Nice mouth. Why don't you try to lay off the Scots, Junior? Suck on it. Real nice. Let's go to the game's MVP. <laughs> with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's game was brought to you by the Hexon Oil Corporation. We drill it, spill it, and kill it.